Desktop widgets are a great feature of Windows because they help improve productivity and provide useful information such as the time remaining on the battery, a computer's performance or important events that are scheduled for a day. Widgets were introduced in Windows Vista and for some reason Microsoft decided to remove them from Windows 7 until now. Today I'm going to share some awesome widgets for Windows 11 you should have that includes not just the ones from Microsoft but also some interesting third party ones. Let's start. Starting with Microsoft widgets, these come built in your OS. In settings, go into personalization, scroll down and open taskbar. Here enable the widgets toggle. After this, you'll see the widgets app at the bottom left of your screen. Here you can check the weather, create a list of the tasks that you need to do, monitor stock levels, check the score of the teams you follow, your scheduled events for the day are some of the things you'll find here. You can customize each widget by selecting the three dots as per your preference. Also, you can add and remove widgets by clicking on the plus symbol at the top. These are some of the basic widgets provided by Microsoft and they're quite simple. If you want more options for customizing your desktop, using third-party widgets can be a great way to add variety. For this, I recommend you to install a program called RainMeter. This will allow you to customize your computer by adding wallpapers, themes and widgets. These are called as skins. After installing the program, head to this link and download the Win10 widgets. Once the file is downloaded, click on it to install it in RainMeter program. Done! As you can see, some widgets will appear on the screen, like battery time indicator which displays the remaining time since the original battery icon doesn't show it, the Wi-Fi indicator indicating how good or bad the connection is, a volume slider which I prefer over the vertical slider, a performance combo that shows computer's current resource usage and many others. You can add or remove any widget as per your choice and customize them according to size, transparency, position and more. Apart from this, you may install the gadgets package from the same website which gives widgets for weather, CPU usage, a calendar that is always sitting on the desktop and a lot more. Again, all of them can be customized including the font color. The last widget package on my list is World Time. This widget shows world time of 6 cities at the same time and can be a useful widget to stay updated of the time zone of your international clients or friends or relative living in different countries. The only problem with this widget is that you'll need to put in some effort into changing the locations shown here because you'll have to manually change each city as per the latitude and longitude. Thankfully, the guide that comes along with this does a good job of helping you. I'll include the links to all these packages in the description which will make it easy for you to download them. Keep in mind that using widgets from Microsoft or in RainMeter will use more system resources and drain the battery on your device. Did you like any of the widgets I mentioned in the video? If so, do comment below which ones you will be using. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you back again next week. See ya!